I'm pretty sure it was the summer we went down and this club was at the Windath then. So let's talk about it. Hello and welcome to the video. And um, could you like, share, and subscribe to the channel? I'd much appreciate it. Liking helps the algorithm. Share and get in front of people's face and subscribing, like if you know, like channel. Hit that notification bell to let you know when videos go live and everything else like that. So we're in a situation where players are out of contract can sign pre-contract uh, over abroad. Uh, you've got the thing with Dan de Liege with Backington, and now we got it with Windass. Now, if you remember, uh, I believe it was the year we went through all the coaches, um, kind of thing. But Club Atletico tell us, uh, I understood an interesting signing, uh, Josh Windass again. Now, it would be a it would be a pre-contract agreement, I think, uh, for him. But they are interested in, in him again. And it's interesting when you look at what got said today in the press conference with v Paul. Uh, he said that Josh is always asking him questions on how to learn better and stuff. And Josh is also taking Spanish lessons as well. So it will be interesting to see if this happens again. Um, I, You know what? I'm quite okay in a sense, if he did go, because he's been a good servant for us, he's done well, he's always played well for us as well. Uh, he's, he's always put a shift in. He's always put a shift in. And you can't not knock him for what he did uh, to help us get us up with the goal in the final, even though he, in his own word, he played naff. And so I will be interested to see what happens with here. But this is the thing we got. There is a lot of players in this very much um, day where they can just go sign free contracts and we wouldn't get nothing for them in terms of what we would need to get for them. And I think that's something we have to start being a bit more careful with. You want to get players for good money, uh, but we have to start being more careful. And... Josh, like I said, he's served us well. He's always played very well when he bid, put the shirt on. It could be a thing. Last time it came out and it got said, he was very much uh, like, yeah, it is what it is. Um, but we're not going to be able to uh, do it. I'm going to stay here. I want to stay here. I've got things I want to do. I've got unfinished business. But he could he go back to Club Atletico Tellers? Possibly. So it's interesting. Um I say back, he was never there in the first place. I meant back with this rumour. But let's see what happens. I think it can be an interesting period, this window. I've said it before that I think this window is going to be fun in terms of what we get in, who we try and tie down to new deals um, and stuff like that. So let's see what happens. But let me know what you think in the comment section below. Would this be one you'd be okay with saying thank you for your service, Josh, in the summer and letting him move on? Let me know.